Jim in three minutes, boy. Three minutes. Come on. Three minutes. Three minutes. Why the bloody hell have you got Christmas tree lights on? Oh, yeah. Same off. I'll pass out. So I have a personal trainer come to my house four days a week and train me. And every single time I'm training, before working out, I have a coffee and a Barocca. I don't know if he's awake or whether he's just sleepwalking. Hey! <laughs> Joe said he hasn't been up this early since he used to thatch roofs. That was legit Joe's job before YouTube. Bro, you used to wake up at like five. Probably even earlier. I didn't finish my coffee, is that a bad thing? Well, it depends whether you need the energy. You playing Fortnite? Mate, I did, I had one game. 50 50, became first, I got six kills, five kills. He didn't. I was on fire. He's lied. Everyone else is getting ready. He's still in his gym clothes. <laughs> Hand cannon and tactical shotgun, mate. Can we take a moment, just before the vlog begins, to fully appreciate my trousers today? Look at them. They're so crazy. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm obsessed. <laughs> I literally, I literally said, how's it going? <laughs> Zoe's going through her 10 million different, what are these called, like Polaroids? Yeah, I really like this one of me and you. But I'm matching t-shirts in alpha. New York. Yo, we took a lot. Sean. Oh, look at us there. That was Amsterdam. I like that picture. I wore oh, no, that's not New York. Margate, Amsterdam. 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 I was just saying, if anyone has any ideas of what to do. How to make all of these into something that's more than just all of this, let us know in the comments. I bet there's probably a lot of really great ideas on Pinterest if we searched. Probably. I think I'll let you and the person who gave you a tattoo. Let us know down below in the comments if there's anything that is super creative way for us to store all of these images or whether we like make them into a video or whether we put them in like Tanya and Jim have this really cool piece of art in their house where they have a load of pictures like these, loads of Polaroids from their wedding and they're almost like frozen like in the middle of like a Perspex box. They're like, I don't know, it's really cool. What are you doing in your little bed? It's so deep, I'm surprised she likes that. Oh my god, a rare photo of me and Sean. Every time we go away, I say to Sean, we need to get a photo together because we never, I have never taken a picture with Sean. And there is a rare photo of me. <laughs> and it's so whitewashed, it's you so, can't see. To be fair, there are a few, but it's just so funny how I always forget to get a photo together. I don't know if I've ever opened up and told you guys, but I actually have somebody who helps me out edit my vlogs. <laughs> and that person is Nala. <laughs> She keeps me company whilst I'm editing, don't you? Whatever time of the day, whether it's early morning, late at night, in the office, she's my little co-editor. I'm excited to have to say that I've finally got two different versions of hopefully the right charger that can charge the quad bike that I bought the other day. I've also purchased tons, and I mean tons, of ping pong balls. We've got a table tennis table, but we have no table tennis balls. Now we have more than enough. It's currently lunchtime. Still sticking to this healthy eating, guys. Got chicken and lamb, little bits of meat, and a, um, a quinoa salad that I bought from Nando's last night. But I purposely got it extra, like I ordered too much so that I could have it today. I don't know if that's like something you can do, is keep Nando's till the next day. But it's not like it's only meat, it's literally just vegetables, so I'm guessing it's fine. See you later! See you later! I mean, yesterday it saved so much time, I might as well. Might as well do it again, guys. Quick little scooter. 
Blooming neck. Look all of that time it saved. I feel like I haven't even proper said good morning. Good morning, guys. It's not the morning anymore. Good evening, guys. How you doing? Hope you're having a nice day. It's Sunday for me. I know I've said this before in vlogs, but Sunday for me used to be when I was younger, like the chill day. Saturday was like, go out with your friends, go out with your family, have a ton of fun. And then Sunday was just like relaxing. And now Sunday for me is literally like tidying the house, taking all the rubbish out, doing the recycling, cleaning up like after everything from the photo shoot. Like it's just like a, a sorting day. So that's been predominantly most of the day. However, now, I'm just going to meet up with my friend Holly. You all know Holly. I'm going to go pick her up now. And we're heading out to go see the Vamps perform in Brighton tonight. Like, how sick is that? And also, Dan and Phil, I didn't get a chance to go and see them yesterday. So annoying, because I only found out on the day at, like, lunchtime that they were performing yesterday. They did a show, and I was messaging Dan and Phil, both of them, yesterday. Like, oh, guys, I didn't realise you are in Brighton. And they're like, yeah, I know, it's our first show. So I hope the set doesn't set on fire. And I was like, guys... You're gonna smash it. Brighton is the best audience ever. Today is also a big day for me because I've just announced to everybody about the A to Z gin bar at the Brighton Foodies Festival. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, my new company with Zoe, A to Z, we've got our own gin bar. We've teamed up with Daffy's Gin down at the Brighton Food Festival from the 5th of March, <laughs> not March, 5th of May, like Saturday coming until Monday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, the bank holiday. Um, we have our own gin bar. So if you're over 18 and you want to come along to our gin bar, A to Z30 is a discount code for tickets. Links down below. Go check it out. Anything else that I need to update you on? Yeah, we're going to see the Vamps tonight. Like now. Like I'm about to leave now to go and see the Vamps perform, which I'm super excited about because they always put on a savage show. And I've been texting James and stuff about grabbing some drinks and things before. But then I realised that I get in the car and now I can't drink. I'm like, yeah, of course, let's grab some gin and tonics. Now I'm driving. No gin and tonics. But I shouldn't be doing that anyway. I'm meant to be being healthy. In fact, no, I am being healthy. So I shouldn't be doing that anyway. Um, anything else to update you on? Normally, I don't tell you about packages and things that I order until it arrives. But since we spoke about it in the vlog the other day, I want to chat with you guys about it just because I'm so excited. And the order's fully gone through. And I got an email confirmation saying it's going to be arriving in less than 10 days. Is You know, the other day, the vlog got a ton of views. It got like 900,000 views when I bought that baby, the doll, the other day. Uh, I can't even remember what we named her. We bought a doll the other day, and uh, and I was talking about Zoe and I taking it out for the day half each, seeing what it'd be like to be a parent. And Zoe was like, "No, do you know what'd be even better? Would be if we got those babies that you can get in schools where they cry like 20 times a day. You have to like pat them on the back. You have like they like literally like test you. It's called something like a ready or not baby." I think it is, which it basically shows you if you're ready or not to have kids. So they're going to be arriving in less than 10 days. And then we can legit do me with one and Zoe with one. I bought a boy and a girl. And we can see who legit can look after a baby better, Zoe or myself. So get excited for that vlog. If you are excited, let me know. Give the video a thumbs up and stuff. I'm so excited. They were quite expensive. So I'm thinking afterwards we either like test it with friends and family or like Joe or something or we just give them to like a school or something to uh, to use afterwards for actual like, educational purposes or we just give them to a ton of different YouTubers to try the same thing and see who can get the best score. I don't know. I should really get going. I need to leave. I need to turn my camera off because I said to Holly's, Holly that I'm going to be at hers in 19 minutes and it takes about 20 minutes to get there. So um, actually I was going to be early. Now I'm not going to be early, I'm just going to be on time. We're going to go for dinner first, before seeing the vamps. Yo, that looks insane. Come on, the Arancini and the cheese pot, and then I want one pizza and one pasta. <laughs> I've just met up with Holly and she says she doesn't know what to do because she wants one of every starter they sell in ZZ. How do you, how do you make any decision? There's the least that we want to stop now. We don't have. Oh no, okay. There's calamari on there because I will scream. Calamari, small, calamari, big, out of stock. That's why he's got some Aren't that so upsetting? Holly's happy with herself because she's taking a picture of me with my two dinners. <laughs> Don't understand. Well, I need to eat a lot at the moment, you know? I'm trying to put on muscle. Yeah! <laughs> oh my god, I've just died! Oh. 
Right, we're finally on the way to go see the vamps. That food took a long time. And I've just warned Holly that I'm so full up that I don't know if I can dance. You have to. And she said you have to because one of their songs is called Can We Dance? Well, and I'm we like can. And I'm like, boys, I don't know if we can because because I'm so full up. So hopefully they perform that towards the end of their set so that I can indeed I can dance. Because right now I might have to like um sit. Or or waddle. <laughs> can we sit? Can we like go like this? Can we bop? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you're someone that doesn't like to get chased. No, I don't. <laughs> Who likes to get chased? I don't know. The amount of times I've been to this venue and I did not know that there was boxes. Keep the lights off. Awesome, thank you. I spend a lot of time. It's like a tiny little box. <laughs> Holly's favourite ones, come on! Guys, can we also appreciate the stage? This stage is so bloody big, which means that these guys get to come and like interact with so many people. So cool. This song is a savage. We're going down to dance. I don't know if this is a good idea, but let's just do it. They've given us these AAA passes, access all areas, so let's just go. The last song has just finished. Now we gotta get going. You got this is the worst decision we've ever made. What is <laughs> at the same time. What? Yeah. And walk at the same time. Yeah, yeah, wait, let me get to the bottom. Obviously, I can't do it and you, walk because I'm using no, my feet. Don't do it. Try and come all the way down the steps Obviously like that. Yeah, you can. Someone's doing it wrong. Try and move your hands down. I'm going to fall. No, keep going. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm going to fall. No, keep going. Can we just have a round of applause? <laughs> Bloody hell. <laughs> I didn't film anything. What are you doing? <laughs> But we've just been for drinks, non-alcoholic, because I'm driving. I had a lime soda with uh, James from the Vamps and Kirsty. It was super lovely getting to see those guys. Just got back from such a sick night. That was so much fun. It is always the nights when you have the least plans that turn out the best. Like, I knew obviously I was going to the Vamps, but I didn't know that Holly was going to end up coming. I didn't know that we'd end up going and getting some drinks afterwards with James. I didn't know that we'd be... Just, I don't know, just having fun, it was cool. I need to leave the vlog here, guys. It's time for me to end the vlog. It's currently 12.15. It's quarter past midnight. I've got the gym at 7.30 tomorrow morning. So I need to get my butt to sleep. But before, every single day now in the vlogs, I shout out somebody who has subscribed and also hit the little bell, turned on the notifications. So once you've done that, let me know in the comments or tweet me a screenshot or something. Today's notification shout out goes to Eleanor, love your days on Twitter. She has got all three of my YouTube channels with notifications turned on. 
she's a true member of the PB club. If you're also in the PB club, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe, ding that little bell button. And I'm guessing, hopefully, I'll see you with another vlog tomorrow.